My name is William Hutchison and along with my wife, I'm the owner of the two real estate companies that you see in the thumbnail. My video today is the first in a series of five of unfurnished rental properties. Uh, today we're going to talk uh, specifically about four condominiums. The links will be below that you can uh, have a look at the, the, the listings and the photos and so on. I'm going to make a few comments uh, just in general. The links are there if you want to go into more depth uh, then you can do so. They're all in Spanish. You can cut and paste to uh, Google uh, Translator and you'll get them back to the English um, uh, the English uh, language. Uh, I'm going to refer to my notes but uh, they, they're going to be brief. Uh, just kind of the highlights of each and every building and maybe something to look at and to pay attention to. All of these are on Centenario. Now Centenario is about a maybe a 10 or 15 minute walk depending on where you are. It's quite a long uh, four lane road north south. Uh, it's probably 15 minutes to Central but anywhere it's a good location if you use taxi anywhere would be no more than $1.50. It's um, it's it's a good area now there's condominiums on centenario and if they're on the main uh, on the front uh, you don't want them i don't think any of these are there's another section of centenario though uh, towards the east where you go down laneways of maybe 150 or 200 meters and the building is down there and they have fantastic views uh, they're very quiet uh, it's just a nice place to live so i have no um, compunction at all about talking about four on Centenario. I think any of you would be happy over there. The first one is a three and two, a uh, thousand square feet, nice size, has a pool, sauna, and gym, and they're asking two million one, which is five hundred and twelve dollars a month. Right now, I'm using forty one hundred to the uh, dollar. Uh, my experts are saying that the a peso at some point is going to start to weaken and by the end of next year it'll be back to perhaps 45 or 4600. Uh, of course that's a forecast and there's no guarantees of that. The uh, second one also Centenario a two and two if two is big enough for you. It's a little more than half the size of the first one 550 square feet has a pool and gym a uh, million six but it's only 390. Uh, has a nice vista as well. The third one is Centenario. Uh, it's uh, two and two, 750 square feet, nice size for a two bedroom condo. Uh, pool, gym, and a games room. Uh, this is a nice apartment. It's $1,700, $415 a month. Uh, to be honest, out of the four, it's my favorite. I like it a lot. The last one uh, is again Centenario, another three and two, 900 square feet, nice size, uh, has a gym. There's no mention of a pool, but this is a new building, no pool in the photos, so maybe it doesn't have one, but that would be highly unusual. The one thing that might be with this uh, apartment is in some cases the builders do all of the apartments and they do the pool at the end. And maybe the space is there, uh, the hole for the pool, but it just hasn't been uh, completed. And that's why it isn't in this, uh, in this listing. I would be very surprised that this building didn't have a pool. Uh, what I really like about this is the windows, the huge windows in the master bedroom kind of corner windows. That really adds a lot, a lot of natural light to that room. This one is 1,800 and that's 439 a month when you um, convert it to US dollars at 4100. That's it for today. I'll finish the series over the next maybe couple of weeks. I'm also going to do a series of five on buys. I've got another one coming on safety in uh, Colombia. Um, I, I have a lot of material to cover and hopefully we'll get through them all by the end of, of November. These rentals I think give you a good idea of what you need to pay to have a nice condo here. Um, I know I have one here over 500. That's kind of unusual. 
uh, I think the 400 to 450 range, uh, if you're coming, is what you should plan on having to spend. But that is, um, you know, in buildings with pools and gyms and saunas. You can get into some of the older apartment buildings a little bit cheaper, but a lot of them don't have pools. And it's just a, a different environment. They're, they're older. These are all modern designs with a, a lot of natural light. That's it for this video. William Hutchison, Armenia Columbia Realty for Expats dot com and um, Salento Columbia Realty. Don't forget, please, if the channel is of interest to you, please subscribe. It helps get the information out to people who might want to consider coming to Colombia. Uh, the lifestyle is fantastic. Armenia is paradise. I live in paradise and you can too.